Atelier Aisha, The Alchemist of Dusk, Aisha no Atori Tilda Huang Hun no Dada no Lian Jin Shushi Tilda, Asha no Atori Tilda Tezager no Daichi no Renkenjutsushi Tilda, Lit. Atelier Aisha Tilda Alchemist of the Land of Dusk Tilda is a Japanese role-playing video game developed by Gust Co., Ltd. The character designs are by Hidari. It is the 14th title in the Atelier series, coming after Atelier Maruru, but has a storyline independent from previous titles in the series. The game is the first installment in the Dusk storyline. An English language release was published in March 2013 by Tecmo Koei in Western regions. A PlayStation Vita version titled Atelier Aisha Plus, The Alchemist of Dusk, Aisha no Atori Plus Tilda Huang Hun no Dada no Lian Jin Shushi Tilda was released on March 27, 2014 in Japan. There is also a drama CD and novel based on the game. Topic. Premise Atelier Aisha stars Aisha Altugal, who runs an herbalist's workshop with her sister Neo. After Neo disappears mysteriously, Aisha meets an alchemist called Keith Griff Hazeldine, who reveals that she must master the art of alchemy herself in order to rescue her sister, but she has only a few years to do so, or Neo will eventually be lost forever. Overcoming sadness is one of the game's themes and players will see Aisha grow as she writes diary entries, while she gathers allies and improves her alchemy skills in her quest to reunite with her missing sister. Atelier Aisha takes place in a new world separate from the Arland saga where the art of alchemy used to thrive in the past, but now only a few know about its secrets. Topic. Gameplay The game proceeds through that the player completes objectives through harvesting items, combat, or fusing items together. Objectives are given as the game's story proceeds. There is, however, no systematic objectives, and the only goal is to reunite Aisha with her sister Neo again. Instead, the player will have to find out answers by making their own choices and in so doing, continue the story. Combat commences when the player character comes in contact with an enemy. The battle system is turn based, and the fastest of the participating characters will receive the first turn. The distance between the player's characters and the enemies has an effect on the battle. The game's main character, Aisha, is the only character in the game who can use items in battle, which is the main element in the game's battle system. The party of characters can support each other by performing actions such as defending or attacking, and characters that are close to each other can support each other with attacks. There are also skills and items that are effective within a certain range. When an enemy is attacked from behind, a back attack occurs, which will make the attack into a critical hit. The player is able to write in a diary by using points obtained from completing objectives. The diary allows the player to look back on the story so far, as well as obtain bonus rewards. Topic: Characters. Aisha Altugal, Aisha Ruto Ru Asha Arituru. Voiced by Marina Inoue, Japanese, Erika Harlaker, English. The protagonist of the game. Aisha is an herbalist who ran a small workshop with her grandfather and little sister Neo until her grandfather died and Neo goes missing. Despite being left alone, Aisha remained upbeat and continued to run the workshop. One day, Aisha sees an apparition of Neo by her supposed grave. 
Convinced that her little sister is still alive, Aisha sets off on a journey to discover the means to save her. The knowledge of alchemy has been passed down in her family, but she doesn't recognize herself as an alchemist. Neo Altugal, Neo Aruto Ru Neo Arituru. Voiced by Maria Eyes, Japanese, Kira Buckland, English. Aisha's younger sister who disappears one day while out gathering herbs. After a long search by Aisha and nearby villagers found no trace of the girl, she is assumed dead, and a gravestone is erected at the place of her disappearance. The truth is that she has been captured by an alchemy creation that has gone out of control and she is reunited with Aisha after a battle against Yggdrasil, Keithgriff Hazeldean, Kisugarifu Hezerudane Kisugarifu Hezerudane. Voiced by, Joji Nakata Japanese, Richard Epcar English. An experienced alchemist from another country with keen interest in ancient times. He's a calm and collected gentleman in pursuit of knowledge. Keithgriff first encounters Aisha on one of his visits to an ancient ruin and points the young girl towards alchemy as the key to saving her younger sister. In battle, Keithgriff doesn't use a weapon, instead relying on alchemy-related attacks, which he summons from his magic ring. He is on a journey to rectify the wrongdoings of alchemists before him and to pursue the ultimate truth, though he is considered a criminal in his native country after having destroyed various facilities and documents. He fights Aisha over a flask found in a village that all inhabitants have disappeared from, but he is valuable to Aisha, though that he isn't aware of it himself that he has come to help her. Regina Curtis, Regina Kadisu, Regina Kadisu. Voiced by Fumi Mizusawa, Japanese, Wendy Lee, English. An acquaintance of Aisha who makes his living selling artifacts excavated from ruins. Despite being a woman, she is considered one of the strongest amongst the prospectors, a group consisting mainly of heavily built men in their prime. Regina is a sociable and reliable girl with a bunch of younger siblings to take care of. Wilbel Voler's lead, Uiraburu Vioru Erisorito Uiraburu Boru Erisorito. Voiced by Asami Seto, Japanese, Christina Valenzuela, English. A girl who comes from a family of witches. Described as being cute and wearing a black pointy hat, Wilbel is a genius when it comes to magic, but knows that she is a long way to be acknowledged by her great great grandmother, to whom she looks up. Despite fighting with a broom, Wilbel is still learning to fly as a proper witch. To prove herself to her great-great-grandmother, she attempts one of the ultimate goals of the sorcerers and challenges the Wind Ruler. The Wind Ruler grants her powers after witnessing her protecting Aisha, Linka, Rinka Rinka. Voiced by, Ami Koshimizu, Japanese, Julie Ann Taylor, English. A calm and collected swordswoman that acts as Marion Quinn, bodyguard. By Marion's request, she offers her assistance to Aisha, who in return helps in her efforts to improve her cooking and make other friends, with dubious results. She used to be a criminal, but she was captured and then saved by Marion. There exist at least seven others with the same appearance as Linka, as well as whom all possess the same name. Their personalities are however different. Juris Gruden, Urizu Gurundan Urisu Gurindan. Voiced by Kosuke Toriumi, Japanese, Patrick Seitz, English. A hunter who wants to defeat a dragon and wear its scales as armor. Despite his stoic demeanor, he is very protective of his sister Nanaka, and watches over her from afar as she looks for pasture for their cows. Juris fights using a hatchet and crossbow. Marion Quinn. Marion Quinn, voiced by Kana Ueda, Japanese. Michelle Ruff, English. 
an office worker from a large faraway city in a western country. Marion is tasked with gathering information about the area. She is small in size, but firm, and loves cute things. She captured Linka in the past, and Linka now serves as her bodyguard. She is also looking for Keithgriff, who committed crimes in their home country. When she realizes how important he is to Aisha and his thoughts, she decides to let him go free. Her name is romanized as Marion Quinn in the Japanese language version of the game, Odelia. Odiria voiced by Kaori Sadahara, Japanese, Kira Buckland, English. An automaton constructed with alchemy. She is the librarian of a library that collects information about alchemy. She can't express feelings very strongly, and her memory has begun to get worse. She searches for a book for Aisha in the library's collection, and she begins to become more human-like in her behavior by interacting with Aisha. She is the guardian of knowledge and compliments to the guardian of life, Yggdrasil. After her new master Keithgriff orders her to no longer follow orders, she proposes to come along with him on the journey he is about to set out on. Her name is romanized as Odilea in the Japanese language version of the game, Harry Olsen. Hari Orison, voiced by Mitsuaki Madono, Japanese, Ray Chase, English. The manager of a company with great influence. He holds a great interest about the ancient times and collects relics that others may view as trash, Yggdrasil. The guardian of life who was made through ancient alchemy. He compliments Odelia, the guardian of knowledge, wind ruler. Feng No Wang, the regent of the wind spirits, Marietta Muir. Marietta Mayua, voiced by Satomi Sato, Japanese, Carrie Savage, English. An enthusiastic clerk who works in a shop owned by Harry. She manages the shop by herself since Harry is busy with his personal interests. Her name is romanized as Marietta Muir in the Japanese language version of the game, Ranan Ett's. Ranan Etsu, voiced by Taiki Mitsuno, Japanese, Johnny Yong Bosch, English. A traveler with no employment. He is devoted to creating art by playing music on his bagpipes, Nanaka Grudin. Nanaka Gurundin, voiced by Asuka Ogame, Japanese, Wendy Lee, English. A nomad who, according to her family's customs, keeps cows and travels in search of pastures. She is Juris's younger sister, Ernie Littleton. Aini Ritarudin voiced by Noriaki Sugiyama, Japanese, Bryce Pappenbrook, English. A traveling salesman who is like a parental figure to Aisha, Tanya Volta. Tanya Foruda voiced by Iori Nomizu, Japanese, Michelle Ann Dunphy, English. A girl who mines salt together with her family in a desert, Fred Rodfork. Ferretto Rodofoku voiced by Tetsu Inada, Japanese, Jameson Price, English, and bread obsessed baker who has set up shop in Virzeburg. He has a crush on Marietta, and changes moods drastically when she is around. Kyle Terenbert, Kairu Terenbata voiced by Kenji Najima, Japanese, Kyle Hebert, English, and barkeeper in Hornheim. He behaves in a very laid-back manner towards his customers and even rents out the room next to his tavern to Aisha for use in alchemy. Topic: Atelier Aisha Plus. Atelier Aisha Plus, The Alchemist of Dusk, Aisha no Atori plus Tilda Huang Hun no Dada no Lian Jin Shushi Tilda is a PlayStation Vita port of the game with additional content. It was released in Japan on March 27, 2014. 
This port includes almost all downloadable content that is available for the PlayStation 3 version of the game, such as costumes and characters, as well as new content, such as a harder difficulty to play the game in, new enemies and costumes and the ability to change the members of the party at any time. Topic. Reception The PS3 version of the game received a Famitsu review score of 3040ths, whilst the PS Vita version attained a score of 2740ths. Topic: Media. Topic: Novel. A novel by the name Aisha no Atori Tilda Aruli Enjin Shushi no Lu no Riji Yori Tilda was released on March 26, 2013. The novel details events that was not included in the game, in the form of eight short stories. The novel was written by Toru Shizuki, illustrated by Hiroki Harus, and published by Koei Tecmo. Topic. World Guide CD A CD narrated by Marina Inoue and Maria Eyes was bundled with pre-orders of the PlayStation 3 game in Japan. It is called the World Guide CD, wa Rudagaido CD. It contained explanations of the setting of the story and there were six different designs available for the record's surface.